Hello babes, welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited for this video because I'm going to be showing you guys a few different things. There's a try on haul that I'm going to be doing for you guys in the next minute or so. And if you guys are new to my channel, if you want to subscribe, make sure you do. Click the bell so you don't miss any one of my new videos. You guys will get notified about them. And also, I've left my two IG pages down below. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a big like throughout the video or by the end of the video. And also, leave your comments and love down below. I'm also going to go through my handbag collection, which is something i've never really done with you guys and i get like lots of questions about what other handbags i have because i always show you guys like what i have purchased but some of you guys are new some of you guys have just recently followed me and haven't seen all my bags you know but let me start off by showing you guys the try on haul first i'm going to be showing you some pieces from white fox boutique thank you so much to them for gifting me these pieces i'm actually wearing two pieces from them right now and i also have a coupon code so you guys can save 15 percent off site-wide everything that i try on is also down below in my description i also leave my sizing coupon code will be there as well just in case you guys forget it i've been meaning to try out their pieces so i'm so excited to show you guys all the pieces that i got from them today white fox boutique has white fox active and white fox swim on their website as well so if you guys are looking for anything make sure you guys check it out on the website they offer afterpay for us new zealand and australian customers and they also have express worldwide shipping on their website i love these pieces i feel like they're so versatile let's get started okay so this piece here you guys saw me wear in the intro with the white bodysuit that i'm also going to be showing you guys but this one i believe they sell these guys separate not as a set textured cotton blouse which i'm so obsessed with right now because i'm really feeling like the boyfriend vibes which i normally don't because i'm so super feminine but i'm just like opening up to so many different trends and i've always loved even like last spring and summer i loved these blouses so much it's so comfortable you guys this one is a size small medium it does have a very loose kind of oversized fit this is like such a perfect set if you guys are going on vacation this bodysuit i'm also wearing in the intro in white but i wanted to show you guys that there is stretch to the fabric the very spandex kind of um almost like more on the dressy not dressy but you can definitely like dress it up so it does have the button closure at the bottom and it is a thong at the back as well it's not a full one guys one thing i have to mention about this bodysuit it's also like hugging your body and almost acting as shapewear i've always told you guys in all my hauls anything that has ruching is going to grab your body so nicely and give you such a beautiful shape i will say that it fits like a four so it's super fitted on me but if you want it to be more of a comfortable fit then just know it's not going to like really grab you and do everything that i'm saying so i could also do a medium and i feel like the medium would fit like a size six i got two of these tops i got them in two different colors i got like a camel nude color like the white is so fresh you guys i've actually already worn this i love this all you have to do is stick you know those like um bikini pads that come inside of your bikini like the top what i do is i actually keep those guys and then i'll wear them like just stick it in with tops and they kind of act as like nipple covers basically you know i did get this one in a size small and for example a small in this top is super stretchy very very comfortable and definitely my size so this definitely fits more like a six whereas the bodysuit definitely hugs you a lot more it almost feels like a four it has a rib detail to it and it is a very stretchy spandex kind of you guys can probably tell but with this top funny enough you guys the one thing that attracted me to it was that it was see-through that you can actually see through it i feel like it adds texture you can even see it on the model it just looks so pretty i also love this round dip i feel like it pulls in your waist it's kind of like an optical illusion this top also has a lot of stretch to it you guys it is a very very comfortable i do have this in a small and i definitely would say it fits like a true size six this top over here is just honestly i saw it online and i was like wow that is such a gorgeous gorgeous top i am such a huge fan as you guys know of cowl necks i love the draping that's going on here right at the front it is so subtle it's so minimal so feminine again we have the ruching detail we have like a corset center which is so 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 pretty and then these very dainty skinny straps which by the way have stretch to them this corset top actually has stretch to it because i feel like with these tops they can be very stiff and so i love that when i'm moving in it it doesn't feel like a very stiff kind of corset it has a zipper and this chocolate color again i feel like is so trendy there's just something super sexy about it like literally she said i'm innocent but don't come too close this dress over here honestly it's probably the most stunning dress i've seen in a very very long time 
I love how they did this very textured layer. They added this ruching detail with this fabric and then underneath it has this corset detail and there's also different variations of cream in this dress as well. It is so stunning. It definitely has that very corset vibe. I did get this in a small and I feel like it fits more like a four. So I feel like I would have been more comfortable with a medium. If you're kind of in between, I feel like you can get away with it if you do have a smaller chest. I feel like I am a crew neck lover. Like just call me the crew neck queen because I love collecting crew necks and I was really wanting to try their crew necks because I keep seeing them all over IG and the different ones that they have but this one I have in a small medium it is an oversized fit so super roomy it's like a golden beige kind of color has a little bit of a drop shoulder on the corners you guys can see there and then the embroidery I love 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 embroidery so much I feel like it's so classic such a soft fabric you guys I can't even tell you listen 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 sometimes I like to wear a pop of color I will say for some reason in fall, winter, and now in spring, the color I keep gravitating back to is green. Like this fabric is so damn soft, you guys, that you don't want to get out of these sweatshirts. Like so comfortable. And also I love the contrast of the white because I feel like it's so classic. They actually sent me the joggers and the sweatshirt. I believe this color is called stone. So it's like a really cool like gray pebble kind of color and it just says white fox right over there i love the drop shoulder sweatshirts i feel like those are my favorite this set i actually wore on family day on monday and it was just so comfortable there's something about knowing that you have a matching set in your closet that is just so comforting because you know you have your pants figured out your top figured out and all you need is a pair of sneakers and your bag and you're good to go you know possibly some sunnies because i'm the sunnies queen so <laughs> me claiming to be the sunnies queen and the crew night queen wow that is so me watch yourself this one is a small slash medium definitely has a very oversized fit i believe the pants are also a small medium and you guys will see they're not crazy baggy on me i like when the top is baggy but not when the bottom is too big if you guys enjoyed all those looks give this video a big thumbs up but again don't forget you guys use my code down below steph and so you guys save 15 percent off with white fox and make sure you guys shop everything down below now let's get on with the rest of the vlog guys i want to show you the new nails since the sun is out right now they look so pretty i just finished taking some pics of them I freaking am obsessed with this green right now. I'm calling it that it is going to be the color of the spring and summer. Like, seriously. It's a marbled um, French. And this ring that I'm wearing, I believe the company is pronounced L'Atelier, if I'm not mistaken. But I also got some shoes from them as well. I picked up some tulips yesterday from um, Fortino's. They look so pretty, you guys. And the spring weather is starting to come so i'm so 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 excited but i finally 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 got this i've been like kind of lazy on this i got the new iphone finally i am completely late on it but my phone is really struggling with my memory I, with my job you just need a really good phone every time i go out it's just such like an extra hassle to bring your camera with you and i can easily just pull up my phone and now it's going to be like crazy 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 quality and even the front camera will be really good if i want to use it in the car like is this not my aesthetic like watch yourself it's so freaking gorgeous you guys it is really nice and soft you guys and then on the inside it has like a sweet kind of material i'll link it down below for you guys y'all this little one she loves to play ball can mommy have it you share okay share with mommy good girl sit Oh, girl, see? Leave it. Leave it. Good girl. Okay, get it. Good girl! You want mommy throw it? You want... And then she loves this. She loves tugging. Look how beautiful my girl is. I love you so much, mommy. I love you. I am a huge handbag person. <sighs> They're my weakness. I've seen two Gucci bags. One of them, you guys, they put like the blue and red like stripe. I'll show you guys a picture. And I'm like, oh my god, if not, that is the one bag that I would probably like. But anyways, you guys, I'm going to grab all of the... I'm going to show you guys like how it kind of looks right now. It looks like a disaster. I have to move the top shelf down. I got these acrylic um, shelf dividers. And you're able to put a bunch of dividers, which I like because it's going to stop this from happening. I'm trying to come up with ways because I can be very messy, but then I can be very neat. So it's it's weird. Like now I've just been like grabbing a new handbag because I'm like in a rush and then I just shove it back in here.
So I have the bags that I'm keeping. I'm debating about this one because honestly, like I have it and like I really think it's pretty. But I've never worn it. You know what I mean? I've never worn it. I'm actually going to be listing it on my website, stephaniemacedo.com. And you guys can shop my closet on there. I think I might be posting this one too. It's just so pretty. It's so hard for me to let it go. Nyla is supervising the plastic. Here's another one. Good girl. Thank you so much for all your help, Nyla. I've kind of just divided them equally. These are really good for also, um, like I said, just to avoid mess, to avoid clutters. And I think this last slot, I might grab all of my wallets because usually I have like a makeup bag where I store all my wallets. Another trick, you guys, is to put the wallet that matches the bag, just put the wallet inside the bag. So it's all organized, you guys. I'm so happy with it. I'm putting on this top and I'm like, oh my God, I have to get my lid roller. And I was thinking about the people that are like, how do you always wear like light clothes and not get them dirty? But I'm thinking about the people that wear dark clothing and have to do this lid rolling all the time. Like girl, that is way more than wearing light clothing and just being careful. Like I said, how can I mess this up? I mean, the only way is to like put them over here, but like, come on, like pendeja. Like there's dividers now, so there's no need for you to be doing that. You know what I'm saying? As like you know handbag obsessed as I am you would probably expect me to have more bags but I'm just not like that I like to clean them out if I'm not using you then that means I'm just not interested in you anymore you know what I mean it's such a cute shoulder bag I don't have a lot of like when you're going out to dinner kind of dressy bags so this is actually a really good option I think they still have this available it looks very high-end very designer it actually comes with like an antique it looks like very old on the chain but I feel like I really like that detail dead I always have poop bags like don't ask <coughs> Nyla so this is not my most recent but i feel like my second most recent my memory is not good to count on this one is the mark jacobs camera bag i believe it's called a camera bag no 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 oh god oh the girl watch yourself it's the snapshot if i'm not mistaken so this one is one of my favorites you guys it limits how much you can put in here and i will say it's a pretty like hard leather it's not that it's not that flexible you know what i mean so it's a camera bag so it is designed to be a camera bag and not to be like an everyday bag where you put a bunch of stuff in here so if i put my sunglasses then i have to like remove my little wallet and just put my cards in here so there's a little bit of like an adjustment when you're using this bag i do have this in the color khaki it has this little slot at the back and then it has these two dividers which i love I think there's a poop bag in this one too. Actually, no, there isn't. <laughs> Love the strap on it. So freaking cute. It says the Marc Jacobs matching and everything. You can remove these and you can also adjust the strap. So if you like to carry a bunch of shit with you, it's not the most practical. But for me, I used to be that girl and now I'm like the complete opposite. I barely carry anything with me. Put your five credit cards in here, your, your, your 20 credit cards in here. You know what I'm saying, girl? Get your credit, girl. Let me see if I can remember all these bag names. Okay, This one is the Kira. By Tori Burch. Oh, <laughs> don't correct me if I'm wrong. I did get her in the what? gray Huron, I believe is the color. So this one is just one zipper. It also has room for credit cards again. This one I can fit like my sunglasses, my keys, a lip product. I can fit my wallet. So it's funny because even though this is like pretty much comparable in size to the Marc Jacobs one, this one is a lot more flexible of a leather. Very, very soft leather. And then it does come with the chain. I've been trying to come up with like some sort of a hack where I can make this like a shoulder bag, but it is a longer strap that goes around you, kind of like a crossbody. The hardware on this also has this very dark antique gold. You can adjust it a little bit, but like it stays pretty long when you're wearing it as a crossbody. This bag comes in different colors. I honestly would get like the cream. And for small bag, like she fits a lot, you know? Okay, this one is like seriously like one of the loves of my life. But I've talked about this bag so so many times i've shown this bag so many times what's your name again oh yeah serena <laughs> you're lucky i'm remembering all these days it is by coach i love this bag so 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 much it honestly sold out like freaking 10 times honestly one of you guys told me that you contacted coach and they said that they're not releasing this again they do still have this style bag but they don't have like the khaki um canvas leather and this also comes in chocolate and then the black, so my sister got that one. I, I don't know what it is with this bag. I keep going back to it. I keep going back. And I've done so many things with the strap, you guys. As you guys know, which speaking of the strap, where's my black canvas strap? I don't know where my black canvas strap is. 
I actually got a black canvas strap from Amazon that you can attach because these are removable. But the other thing I love is that you can get a khaki strap and then switch the look and match it with this. So it does come with a top handle so you guys can remove this as a whole and kind of use it as like a little dinner bag. Also shortened it and I like tucked this end in because I really love it as like a shorter like shoulder bag. It also comes with this little pocket at the back which has a poop bag. It also has two dividers so you get front and back zipper. Um, the front zipper has some Kleenex inside of it. Maybe my nose was runny that day or something. And then the back has um, some more poop bags that actually has a whole roll of poop bags as if my dog is going to like literally shit out of her ass that much. Um, it also has a pad which I don't use anymore because I free blade. So I have the khaki slash black color in this. It's also in black, white, there was like a cream version. So if you guys want to get your hands on this, I think they still have the style up. Normally, as my bags get older, I kind of like, okay, I've had you for a while. Like, we need to update you and then I won't use it. But with this bag, it's like a year old now and I just keep going back to it. You know what I mean? My newest baby, this bag over here, what's her name? Oh, for the love of God, I knew it wasn't going to be that good. What's her name? Tell me Okay, I forgot her name. I will put it on screen. This is my newest bag that I got. It does come like you can't change the strap because it comes with this. Like this, I always wear her as a shoulder. I mean, I think I've worn her as a crossbody once. So you can pull this up and it becomes a long crossbody strap. I'm such a shoulder. I used to be such like a satchel girl, like holding my handbag in my hands and so it's just so much more practical to like put it around your shoulder. I believe this comes in black and I'm not sure if it comes in other colors. Is this not the Maddie or am I getting confused? I feel like this is the Maddie. Basically the dupe for like the Chanel bag because it has like the quilted look. This bag is so practical. It is a little bit more on the expensive side. I believe it's $5.95 Canadian, but for you guys, I think it's like $3.95, like 400 bucks. Um, it has this beautiful, I believe this is the new coach. So it also has this antique gold kind of vibe to it. It's not like that very light gold. So and then throughout the actual strap, it has the leather like weaved into it. So this is a very like, she expensive, like she got money. This is that type of bag, you know? It's so practical because my phone goes at the back over here and this is literally the bag that I'm using right now, but it has one big pocket. And then you guys, it also has this that flaps up and then you have pocket here and pocket. What the hell is in here? No, stop it right now. Oh, this bag is so new that there's, what the frick is this? This is more of a medium sized bag to me. But I have this one, which you don't even expect me to know the name of this. Because this one, I don't remember. I purchased this when I was very into like the hobo style bag. This strap actually comes from this bag over here. So these are two different bags. That's why she doesn't have a strap right now. This is just a very minimal, like ultra minimal, nothing really going on. Just has the coach patch. So they're in the same color. This color leather is actually called chalk. That's the same color that the other coach one is done in but actually last night i just switched the strap to the shorter one it doesn't sit too long you know what i mean but i love her she's super super minimal nothing really going on and again this is a little bit more of like a larger bag so if i'm going somewhere where i have to carry a little bit more one of these would be good but now it's just all about the super small like tiny bags and not really bringing much with you love about like getting bags from the same company because you can switch out the straps and usually the leathers are the same you know what i mean so it'll match so I also have the same bag but in black and I did have to like remove, I'm not gonna lie, I do cut off the strap, okay? I'm, I'm like, I'm trying to come up with a way to say it but like the truth is I cut off the strap because I needed to be able to like hook that, um, the smaller strap onto this hook over here and this is not removable so I had to cut off the strap, okay? Sometimes you just gotta do what you gotta do, girl. This bag also, I wasn't sure if I was gonna keep because I never use black handbags, you guys. I never use black bags anymore. But when I'm wearing black and I want something very minimal, I can go back to her. You can see that I only have these two black bags. And then we have the small version. These are not the same style, but I just like to compare them because they look pretty much the same. So again, with just the patch at the front, I can remove this and I can add the strap on her as well. The thing I have in here is some chains. So if I ever want to switch out that little shoulder bag and put a like a dressy chain on it, I have it. You can get these chains off of Amazon. And they're a really great way to kind of dress up your bag without buying a new bag and making it look very high-end designer, very dressy. Guys, I had a feeling while I was filming this video, I'm like, why do I feel like I'm missing something though? And I'm missing my MK bag. You guys are probably like, where's the MK bag that she has? This is the one that I didn't show you guys. I love, love, love this bag. This is the Bradshaw bag. 
I do remember her name. I love her because it has the front pocket over there. Also has a pocket at the back for your phone. And she also has a big zipper throw over there. And then I love the khaki strap that it comes with it, you guys. But love this bag. I will also link this because every time I show this bag, people are always like, oh my god, what bag is that? So she is very, very, very beautiful. She comes in different colors. Actually, this color sold out and then it came back. So check out the link down below because it might still be there. It might not. I'm not sure. I just put those smaller bags into the medium size bags and now I have like a free slot and I also moved up the Dara bag. So basically the bottom ones, well, the top ones also still have designer bags too, but the bottom ones are all my small designer bags. But look how freaking neat this looks, you guys. Like, this is literally, you can't mess this up. Like, hopefully you guys enjoyed organizing and seeing my handbag collection. Hopefully it kind of inspires you guys too. If you guys want the acrylic organizers, I've also linked them down below for you guys. And also any bag that I can possibly link. Don't forget to shop with White Fox Boutique and use my coupon code down below. If you guys are not subscribed, also make sure you guys do click the bell to get notified for all my brand new videos and both of my IG pages are down below give this video a big thumbs up if you guys enjoyed and leave some love down below as well thank you guys so much for watching and i will see all of my beautiful babes in my next video